Hi guys, my name is Alice and today we're gonna go over every single skill of artists and recommended tripods. Disclaimer, meter value is estimated value and it can vary with spec, relic set, or tripod. <laughs> Butterfly Dream It doesn't have any advantages, but has a beautiful uh, skill effect. Recommended rune is quick recharge. Drawing Orchid. This skill is most preferred option by far since it's easy to maintain uptime and it provides weak point and attack speed buff. You usually don't have to invest higher level gems on this skill, but you can put higher level gems if golden feels a bit tight for you. The Blossom Road and Faraway Journey from Third Tripod is your preference. Ink Shower. This skill is the least preferred marking option. No benefit in using it over others. Buff Skills. Drawing the Sun. Drawing the Sun is similar to Paladin's Heavenly Blessing, but without mana regeneration. For Gem, Top priority along with Sunwell for buff uptime or third fourth for meter generation. As for tripod, people usually take tenacity and robust protection. Sunwell. Sunwell is similar to Bart's sonic vibration, but also restores mana. Recommended runes are Gelwin or Conviction. To keep good buff uptime, prioritize city gems and the quick preparation tripod. Meter generator. Hopper. It's used on cooldown for meter with a bonus of giving shield. The skill has clunky and long animations, so you have to be mindful. It's advised to prioritize enhanced energy tripod since Hopper is your highest meter generator. Thor of Illusion. Thor of Illusion is a strong fixed meter gain on use. Perfect for TR phase and also provides a clan. Recommended runes are Quick Recharge, Rage, or Focus. Mine Enhanced Amendment Tripod can be higher priority if your Swiftness or NCDR gems are high. Bouncing Tiger. It generates a lot of meter and thus could stagger also one weak point. You don't have to level this skill higher than 7 unless you need additional weak point from 2 Tiger's Tripod. For them, it's top priority along with quick preparation for meter gain. Spring Ball generates a lot of meter, but often less preferred compared to Bouncing Tiger, due to lower stagger value and slightly higher cooldown. This skill is usually considered as an 8 flex skill along with Milky Way, Brain Wing, or Upward Strong. Others a Sprinkle a Sprinkle is your main shield skill and also highest stagger. For runes, you can replace Overwhelm with Well if the raid doesn't have any kind of tight stagger check. Crane Wing Crane Wing is technically your best stagger, but it's only used as a flex skill because of low meter value. This is also your best Chaos Dungeon skill. You don't have to level it up higher than 4, since other tripods don't improve its performance. Upper Stroke Upper Stroke is your main gauner. Each combo hits gowns as a gauner. You don't have to level it up higher than 7, since the third row is only damage related. Single Stroke This skill has multiple purposes. It's technically the second highest stagger and provides decent meter. It can counter as well, but it's unreliable due to animation speed and long cooldown. But however, you can take Swift Finger and Large Brush Tripods instead to make a reliable long range counter, but it'll lose the stagger and meter value. Recommended runes are Overwhelm or Wealth. Gelwin for counter purpose. Milky Way. Milky Way is your version for Rhapsody or Godsend Law. This is one of your flex skills. 
since you can swap it for another valuable meter gain or a stagger skill. For tripods, it's recommended to take tenacity, but you can replace it with quick preparation. The last two skills are called Drawing the Moon and Rising Ink. These two skills have absolutely no purpose for support artists in PvE, but DPS artists use them. How to make your own skill preset goes like this. 1. Put one macro skill. You don't need more than one. 2. Hopper since it's higher meter generation. 3. Two attack buff skills. 4. And you fill four with your choice, usually sprinkle, tiger, portal for balance, stagger, meter, and sustain. 5. Each skill can be situational depending on what's most needed. It can be counter or make a way for extra damage reduction or spring pool for extra meter or crane wing for heavy stagger. Thanks for watching. You can also follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash alice and make sure you check out the video in the description or come to Lost Stream if you have any questions.